we're just re re putting up our, our teepee that fell down during the storm. So, um, so Chris reached out to the Yes program that's going on at the college right now in uh, Swan Lake, I think, uh, to see if any of the students wanted to come by and help out. Uh, it was actually kind of fun to, to work with them. You know, they're young kids, eh? So, and uh, some of them haven't had a chance to put it up before, so I think it worked out pretty good. That's how our, our teachings are passed down, right, from one generation to the next. And so that uh, having that connection with the, the two, you know, age groups is very important. The most important part is the, the tripod, right? The three the three poles that kind of hold everything up, right? So those two, those three, you know, uh, putting them together, you know, you're weaving the rope in and out and you know, and then tighten it tight and then you get it up. It, 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 uh, it uh, gives the base for, for the rest of the poles and then the other poles just kind of lay beside those ones, right? And it spirals, it's supposed to spiral around there. And then uh, you have, then you have the big pole that comes in and there's always a spot in the back that has a space about that far open and it goes up like that and you can see it when you're putting this pole up. So when you put the tip canvas on, that pole fits right into that, that spot and it wraps right around. Right? So, it's kind of you know, it's kind of interesting because when I put it up, it feel it feels like it's I'm putting it up different every time. Because <laughs> sometimes the pole won't fit right, and we're gonna have to put it over here. Right, but but it, you know it works out. Yeah, I guess you can uh, pull it down now a little bit, the reach, see how tight it is. This is what I would taught us where the TP came from was the coatings. Uh, so it, you know everybody has their own little lodges. I think for me, I was always taught to put to any offerings on the east side. So if, when I go to put tobacco, I put it on the east side. And I put a, a spirit dish, I put it on the east side. Uh, and this door on the east side you know, kind of faces the grandfathers and fathers in the east, right? So, and plus the wind comes from the west most of the times. So if we had the, the other way, we'd kind of just pick it up too. So. <laughs>